He has a new fix for the school bus driver shortage. They're putting taxi drivers behind the wheel. Yeah, a new program has the hope, or with the group Hope Project, is helping former cavies pivot into a brand new career. News 4's Amy Cho has the story. Look how your bus going off that way. Make it come back my way. If you want to be a school bus driver, don't hit no cone. It helps to have good steering skills. If your tire hit the line, they're going to fail you. But for the students in this class, they already know a thing or two about switching gears. The cab business give us a lot of experience. Solomon Katema was a taxi driver for 20 years. He says times have been tough ever since rideshare companies launched. The pandemic was the final blow. We didn't make any money at all, at all. We stay home. Now he and his fellow cabbies can come to this class free of charge to get a commercial driver's license. Look at all this room you got right here. The D.C. government pays the bill. All you got to do is keep your hand on the wheel. In exchange, they promise to drive for the D.C. program School Connect for at least six months. We have to be really good with the kids. I hope we'll do good. We'll do excellent work. I hope so. The group Hope Project teaches the class in Forestville, Maryland. It's awesome that we're in a position to help in such a major way. The group's founder, Raymond Bell, says they've been offering job training for years. Take them past the cone. And that their goal has always been to help folks make a good living. For our students to be showing up on time, staying late, and making a commitment, it brings joy to, to my heart. This opportunity to drive a school bus, it's a good opportunity for us. So we are hoping that our life is going to get better. A new chapter for these drivers now moving forward in their careers. Good job. Amy Cho, News 4. Now the cabbies will drive for the Safe Passage program in D.C. public schools, which offers transportation for students in Ward 7 and 8.